and Scott Origins experience from the beginning. We're going to purely focus on the story play, and we're going to pick up where we left off. So let's see, right now, we have to gather copper. Might as well learn a new word. I mean, that's the story you tell me to do, but basically I'm, I'm going to do the story. I'm going to get stuff that's right next to me. This demo resonates, producing a sound that fills my mind. A vision begins to take shape. A small alien life form kneels before me. They are tired, beating. Without meeting my gaze, they offer out their hand. It's acknowledge. And then Gek floats in my vision. An echo of the strange vision I just experienced. A word in this alien tongue is served into my brain. Gek. What the gek? <clears throat> but what I mean by like focusing on the story is I'm, I'm not gonna like um, build a whole giant base. You know, I'm not gonna do the daily missions. I'm not focusing on the story. So right now it's telling me to get copper. Go get some. So we need sixty. Change the graphics for this. I say like really mixed in the soil there. Usually it's all shiny. That's kind of cool. It's more realistic that it's mixed in and not just uh, the copper to create chromatic metal. Check how the microphone sounds. Let's see. Might get a little echo here. Base computer claims a site for construction. Find a suitable area, a suitable area and deploy the base computer. Any area is really suitable. This looks as good as any. Let's do it right here though. First base built and the restart. All right. Search base computer archives. All right. Access and log from previous user. 
Entry 49D 5D follows. Storm sweeping across, but construction supplies low. Deposit and shuttle plans. Wow. V2 back soon. Extract plans, of course. Ah, uh, ye old wall plan. Okay. Got a bunch of stuff from popping there. So let's see. Construct a base of shelter. Expand your base by earning new construction blueprints. Blueprints. Return to your base to store and process items as you explore. Alright, so we're going to construct a little base. Alright, so... Right here. Put three walls. We'll scan it since we're looking at it. We'll get a few trees here real quick. Is that a double sun? Or is this a light effect? Two more trees for good measure. Where's my little baby gun? I have a thousand hours in my other save, so this is uh, interesting to start from scratch again. this story so that's why I'm starting over to check it out. Alright. Well the roof is the next thing to do. A little shack here. It's tiny but it's home. And of course the door. Archives updated. All right. Access a log from previous user. Additional archives recovered. Entry 4925E follows. Construction largely a success. Recovered salvage data from their bikes. Plans logs. Scans indicate additional subterranean devices. Begin search. Whoever recorded these logs evidently had some success. I have access to their plans and perhaps I can learn from their efforts. Ah, uh, the old new building parts. We need to mag magnetize the All right. All right. So let's take a little bit of shelter real quick here. Okay, we would expand the base. Take up air technology, power your base. Okay. All right, so we need to do this. We need to mine. I don't mine if I have to. Don't mine if I do. It's on my mind. This is on my mind. Okay, so see, good thing I got a little extra carbon. You can never have too much carbon. Let's see, we need ferrite. There we go. Alright.
don't know what these hours are for. Construction Research Unit. Let's get that constructed. <clears throat> oh! Magnetized fire right, I thought. I thought I did that. Ah, purified ferrite. I see, it's been a while since I had to make stuff. Okay, so that means, oops. Okay, so let's get this bad boy out of here. And it tells me right there, place pure ferrite into portable refiner unit. Okay, so there's that. And there we go. Okay, test and construction research unit. Analysis. Analysis unit online. All right, so we are doing variable technology research structures. Let's see. <coughs> so teleporter. We can unlock that. All these guys we can unlock. Okay, we'll start for the wood first. We don't need to teleport yet. But let's see, what does it want me to do? Explore the planet and locate buried technology. All right, we'll go what it tells me to do for now. Okay, let's see, buried technology. Aha, here we go. For the exosuit, I wish they'd have subtitles as an option. I like to have subtitles in my game, so if I don't hear I can read it. Alright. Okay, there we go. And now we're going to learn some stuff at the blueprint. Yeah, this makes the game a little more exciting again. It's like, whoa, I'm weak. Yeah, the game I started in, the first planet I landed on was like fire, but the plant right next to it, paradise planet. So I got lucky there. Oh, this dude is so out of shape. He can't run too far. All right. to get um, use the data to learn new construction blueprints oh so it's my choice pick whatever I want I'm gonna go for wood since they start with wood yeah, we don't we don't need this do we although to come back here well no I don't I, yeah I don't need that let's go for wood so let's go for 
let's see, what do we want next? Let's go for a smaller wall. And let's go for a smaller floor. All right. Place your new base component. Okay. So let's make, oops. Let's uh, make a little uh, welcome mat, so to speak. It's not really a welcome mat, but that's my imagination. Your base can be renamed and tracked with your base computer. Let's see, we shall name it Juggler Rosams. Explore the planet and locate more better technology. Okay. This time I'm going to fly over. Although I don't want to waste too much fuel because resources are limited right now. Let's see what we got here. Okay. Thrusters. Oh, look at that. Yeah, I don't got much at all. So maybe I want to conserve this. Um, hmm. Can I make metal plating? Okay, so I need some ferrite dust. We might as well scan it since we're looking at it. Yeah, but if you want to keep track of this, follow me, like it. Um, I'm going to do this at least an hour to two hours daily until I complete all the story modes. I'm treating this like if it was real life. Like if real life, sources are limited. Although there's a lot of ferret laying around here. But yeah, next time I think I'll fly. Because ferrite is a very common material. Let me just double check that recipe. So this is metal plate. Yeah, those two items are pretty common. So I have to make a mental note. Oh, I don't like this. Huh. It's floating in the air? <laughs> well, that's an odd place to be buried. It's floating in the air. All right, so I just have to stand on the edge and aim at it. There we go. Right, but so I gotta remember since I'm new in this game, this what these blue crystals you're never gonna have we the, the supplies we want to keep up with are blue crystals. Blue crystals are important. 
and so blue crystals, carbon, and oxygen ferrite. I'm gonna keep a pretty good supply of those. Oops. Because those are our life sustenance right now, our life saving things. Okay. So it wants me to learn the base teleporter. Okay. Ah, I need the advanced mine layer. I didn't get that right in the game. Okay. So on the way, might as well get some more ferrite. Might as well get some more crystals. Stock up on these just to be safe. That's pretty good. Oh, walk right by it, might as well get some. All right. supposed to build it. So we need a little bit more ferrite. I guess I could just use those bunch of tiny stones, but it's faster if we go for a big one. Okay. Oh, look at that beautiful sunrise. Look at that beautiful sunrise. You know what? I'm going to take a quick picture. going to be my picture. This will just take a moment. We're not going to post it. We're just saving it, captured, and we're back to the game. I mean, I love this game. Oh, I love it. Don't get me wrong, but what annoys me is like when you see a plant like this, you can't scan it. You see what I'm saying? Like, I can understand grass you're not going to scan, scan, but uh, it's a little bit annoying. It's like, hey, if it's going to be that big, let me scan it. No big deal, though. <laughs> All right. So now we're going to craft four plates. They've improved this game. The uh, square replicates them much faster now. Boom, boom, boom. Oh wait. Oh, I need a I need 50 per plate. Oh my goodness. So I need three more. So that's 150 more. Okay. So I need 150 total ferrite. Alright. Hundred and fifty total. Four to fifty oxygen. Like I told you oxygen, blue crystals, carbon, ferrite. We gotta keep a supply of this stuff. So if you see some oxygen, grab it. Don't wait for later. You might need it. 
not be close to any. Carving is because uh, I'm going to recharge my weapon soon. Alright. Smart. Alright. Something here. Yeah, that, that gives you more. Those geodes that you find, there's like a whole bunch of them. All right. So let's see, we're gonna build two carbon nanotubes. So there's one, square makes another. Okay, now what? Aha! Now we can build the teleporter. And there's my base symbol. I like how now, when you pointed the base, it says Juggle or Zam's first outpost. Because before the update, it will just say your base. I can't claim responsibility because I'm sure millions of people put suggestions in, but I did go to Hello Games Zendesk and I suggested display the name of the bases. So I'm happy my suggestion made it in. Now, anybody else could have made it as well, but yeah, I thought it was kind of nice. All right, so now we're going to go with the gray red thing. Okay, so we're going to build it, and I'm going to build it on the side, right there. Now what? Supply power to the base, teleport mod. Learn the viral fuel reactor. Okay. So now we're going to learn the viral fuel. So that needs one. So we need some more salvage data. And save frequently. You never know if the game's going to crash. Restore point saved. Okay, so we need some more technology. Alright. I'm going to take the shortcut this time and fly. Even though it is going to take some fuel. So I tell you what, it's faster, but I think I'm going to have to walk it next time because that took away a fourth of it, so I only can make three trips before I need one of these again. So yeah, I'm gonna hold off on the flights from now on. I want enough, enough, enough resources to be flying everywhere, even though it is quicker. Alright. So I'm just gonna go hunting for these a little bit. I got one. And, uh, that's enough to do it, but let's find another. Yeah, let's check out this here part. Okay, so I'm gonna do this soon. Let's look at the log. Okay, yeah, we want to keep in the log here. Okay, so we're doing this part. Okay, learn biofuel technology. But let's see, we're gonna need more of those. Let's see if there's any nearby. More of those. Nope. And that was it. Might as well gather resources as you're walking. And what I always say. Worth it.
sprint depleted. Purchase stamina upgrades at space station. Connect. Okay, learn electrical wiring. Research and electrical wiring is free. Oh, okay. How generous. Okay, wires are free. Save these points for now on because we can do them in order. Okay, so. Connect this, of course. Alright. Feel the bottle, biofuel reactor. Okay. And we have more oxygen, so we'll use that. Or wait, does it just take more? It probably just takes more. All right. Then we got mission complete. For this, anyway. Do I even have anything in here yet? It's such a new game. Yep, just one base. None of these yet. All right. Base computer, log updated, return to base computer. Okay. Access and log from previous unit. Additional archives recovered. Entry 4925F follows. Scanner detected unusual broadcast. Repeating 16 from the space station. Warning. End of archive. Records. Records interrupted. The base computer archives have reached their end. It seems there is nothing more I will learn from them. My predecessor appears to have left their base and headed to the space station. Okay. And they didn't tell me to. I'm going to upload it. You know what, actually? Let's take a nice little picture. It's a little bit far away. Drinky break. Nothing but H2O. All okay. Investigate the space station. Follow in the footsteps of the base computer's previous owner.
Resources are low, never pass up free stuff. Oh, that means pass, but these do not. Mm -hmm. Journey milestone come accomplished. What did I get? Set it out, traveled 8,000 units. I kind of wish they'd have it in miles so I could get the perspective of it. But what are you going to do? So, so far, I woke up on the planet, a little bit damaged. In the game, I have no memory who I am, what's going on. This is what I've discovered so far. I got my ship going, got a little base going. I'm going to go up to the space station. My exosuit, I think of as my iPhone or Apple Watch, because it tells me what to do. All right, here we go. And we're going to pop right out. What's the number one rule in games that don't auto-save all the time? Frequent saving. Okay. So we're going to the space station. Let's do it. Okay, let's see. Where is the space station? There we go. Okay. First time in a space station in the reboot. Space station, find life forms to ask them about the mysterious, mysterious symbol. Life form waits behind the terminal. They look at me up and down and seem to decide I'm not a customer. They do not look particularly helpful. Ask about other travelers. They know I'm broke. The life form looks at me with alarm before waving me away. Way. He ain't talking. He ain't talking at all. Um, let's see here though. Can I get any upgrades? I could get space, but I'm I'm saving my units. Yeah, we're not we're not buying inventory space yet. But I want it sprint upgrades. What's this? Okay, that's. That's for cars, because there's a car behind them. That's for ships. That's probably... Where's the guy that lets me upgrade my run? This guy says. Okay. Repeat 16. 16. We are watching you, traveler friend. Find that we have left you. Though the alien speaks, the words are not their own. A string of code is echoed back to me through a red, the red lair. 
logged directly to my echo exosuit. The crimson light fades away, and I see the light from blinking at me expectantly. Whatever has happened, they do not appear to have seen it. I should leave. I should leave. Perhaps my base computer will be able to make something of this code. Uh huh. Every system has a space station serving as its hub. Speaking of life forms aboard the station brings the chance of trade, learn words or gain stand, visit technology merchants, upgrade your ship and equipment. Cartographer for directions to outposts and other buildings. Take missions of the mission agent to earn by the rewards. You teleport and instantly return to your base. The encoded message has been stored for later use when ready to leave teleport. Use a teleport terminus to return to your base. Well. Huh. Kiss of Lightning. That's the name of the gun. Kiss of Lightning. Let's compare. So six slots is what I have. They have seven. Oh, I don't even have I don't have enough money to do this yet. So we're gonna back out of there. I'm just curious though if anybody else has something different to say. Okay, that's just straight up purchase. Alright, so we're not doing any of that. Let's go back to this dude. Because that wasn't an option before. Oh, can't do it. No. Okay, let's see what's on the other side. The space station. Whoa! I cannot float over there. Look at my long save game. Alright, let's talk to everybody because we need to learn some words. Request dialect help. The. Friendship, mystery, technology, aggression. Try friendship. Help. Might can come in handy later on. Oh, visited him already. There we go. The Gek is shouting to their airpiece. They're totally irritated and self important. They seem unhappy about the business deal that has transpired. We learn words today at this point. Let's try Gex symbol. Friend. What's up, buddy? Let's skip this part since we didn't read it anyway. Keeps looking at my multi tool. They appear envious of the technology. What do they know? It's the cheapest gun there is in the game, dude. What are you doing? Let's see, let's do technology, <laughs> weapon. Ah, another accomplishment. Learn five words. What's up with the blue face? Ah, friend. Okay. There we go. Gek examines me as I approach. They are clearly disappointed. Although the afternoon clues why. Let's learn some more words. Uh, let's do Gek some, since they are a Gek. Federation.
Okay, attendant blade doc. What's up? They seem blurry eyed as if they had been asleep. So Trader sniffs up my exosuit, shaking their head in sadness. It appears to want to help me. Assistant Ironid tilts their head from side to side as they consider me. They consult a note on their data pad, then present a list of language symbols. I'm going to learn all their main words first, which is, I would assume, because of their name. Okay, so first. These guys new? No. Yep. So Kitakatu. Kitakatu, what's up? What do you do? Let's do we do all the gecks first. Eh, maybe I'll mix it up a little bit later. But, but for this station, it's their their stuff. I'm gonna do. Now, although I'm not going to do any missions. Oh, what's this? Journey milestone accomplished. Learned eight words. Now, I'm gonna do the story mode, but I am gonna gain. Oh, what's this? Well, I guess I cannot get any missions. I was gonna try to get some. Just maybe I would get them. Accidentally done. All right, let's talk to this dude. Maybe friends spawn. Life from blurs at me briefly, shaking their head. They seem to be a representative of the guild of mercenaries. Perhaps I could impress them by undertaking work for the mission listen agent. Just out of curiosity, did, does this unlock anything now? If I go there? Nope. I've not earned enough respect yet to be offered a mission, apparently. And let's check this guy out for maps. Okay. Friend in maps. Ask for help. Ask the photographer, Tut, for help. They pointed a map on their screen, then towards the depiction of the waypoint towers found at most planetary sites. They seem to be requesting I gather data from these towers. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. So I think I've visited everybody here on the station. Oh, not this guy. Weapon. Is this a threat, an attempt to intimidate? A boast, a friendly display meant in good faith? Their culture remains so unknown to me. Let's request some more language help. Let's do Viking symbol. Ah, I learned the word for Viking. Okay, Viking. All right, so, I think I've seen everybody. Yup. Another word milestone, I believe. Ten words. Look at me. Oh, one more person. Okay. <clears throat> cookies. Coco, you cookies, love. Coco, I go all right. All right, let's see. Okay, so they're playing a the game. Work egg mud babbles. Wisping symbols in my mind with a delicate firm. Pheromone. Let's keep on doing get some things. Scent. Alright, so I can go to the base now. Oh, which one should I choose? Oh, the only one I have. Alright. Let's do it.
approaching. This stream's been on for about an hour yet. And it's 718. I'll probably go to, to about 8, 830. But yeah, for this reboot, we're going to follow the story. Archives terminated. Select a new task. Begin decryption. Decoding. 16. 16. 16. Message follows. The traveler finds their wings. Fly to us and claim your place among the stars. Hell what? Aha! Another signal. So that's over there. Save the game frequently just to be safe. Okay. Oh, I can't wait to play this game on PlayStation 5. See how much quicker loaders it, it loads up. Oh, can't wait. Let's see. Hey Siri, how many days is it from November 12? It was 328 days ago. No. How many days until November 12, 2020? Hey Siri, how many days is it from November 20, 2020? It's 46 days until then. There we go. 46 days until the mighty PlayStation 5 was unleashed to the world. And I got my pre-order ready to go. So yeah, November 12, as long as I get my pre-order in time, I will be streaming from PlayStation 5. signal received. Alright, let's go to it. The MS Wings of an Anomaly. Partial records available. The signal has led me to the wreck of a freighter. Colossal fragments, metal scattered across the landscape. Were these messages nothing but the misfiring circuits of a long forgotten room? Nestled among the debris, the debris, I find the pilot's log, blinking await input, request log. Instead of displaying the ship's log, the terminal spits out a strange sequence of numbers. They are followed by a short message. The anomaly comes for the stars take flight. The schematic for a hyperdrive is attached to the end of the message. Take blueprint. I pulled the blueprint from the computer, but this hyperdrive blueprint is for a conventional starship, not a freighter of this size. Someone placed this here after the crash, hoping it would be found. New technology discovered. And that's going to let us jump between neighboring systems at warp speed. User is advised to access hyperdrive system through the galactic map. So I need microprocessors and chromatic metal. Okay. Install the hyperdrive and access the ship inventory with the square. I might as well go in here. Alright. Okay. Whoop. Wait, what am I doing? Oh, I gotta I can do square to install technology. Alright. Here it is. 
so we need these parts. Processes. Units you cried 95,000. Sell items at a space station trade terminal when selling Tago Exosuit and Starship inventories with Square. Open the guide to learn how to make money. See how it tells me to do it. Making money. Okay, you can sell items, it just told me that already. Mine precious metals from asteroids in space or use the analysis, analysis visor to locate valuable resource deposits in the planet. The mission board is there, farming. All right, so for now, let's see what we got to sell. Um, so that's worth 1,500. Not too much there. A little bit of there. Some. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so I only need 300 more units. See, so yeah, I got enough to sell. All right. Sell, and then we would have buy circuit boards. We have one already. Okay. Oh, my jetpack ran out right before the edge. selling. Might as well sell these. Might as well sell that. Okay, now buy. Oh wait, actually sell. Let's sell this. Five thousand. I thought I had enough to buy. Twenty-six thousand. What was I looking at? Oh, I was thinking of ninety-five hundred, maybe. So we need to sell more stuff. So. Need 
38 more thousand. Oh, wait. I don't know. But I can make money with a mission. Maybe he'll offer me missions now. Because they didn't last time. Ah! Oh, he ain't offering me no missions. Alright, alright, alright. So we're going to mine some asteroids. We're going to mine some asteroids. Frequent saving. Alright. Let's get that free money float in space. Alright. See how much stuff we got here. Okay, so that's 1,000, 3,000, 13,000. Okay, let's get some more. Let's see what we got now. 8,000, so 11,000, 17. Oh yeah, 
That should be enough, I think. Okay. Let's go back to the space station. Alright. That didn't take too long. I wish in real life I could make uh, tens of thousands of units uh, in about five minutes. That's a lot more than minimum wage, let me tell you. I may be one of them. Units required 95,000. Okay, let's see what this is. I think I understand here. Okay. I skipped the storyline a little bit. Like, I don't think I was supposed to buy them first. I have to reach the 95,000 unit mark. So, yeah, we're going we're gonna to go back in here and sell these guys. Oh, well, that's really valuable. Wow. That's the money maker. There is salvage data. Boom. Okay, see? I had to actually earn the units. I bought them one at a time. Okay, I have to really follow these instructions next time. Okay. So I got ahead of there a little bit. Okay, so we would have buy five of them. And I don't have to go to the hours. You can just push the uh, D-pad. So that's easier. Three. Four, five. Okay. Now what? Gather copper. 250. Locate large copper deposits. for pennies. Oh, what do we got? They earned 140,000, 41,000, units. Sit there. All right. All right, we are going to mine some copper. Hope you don't mind. I'm watching the video. Say copper. Go right down there. Looks like a nice little spot. What would you do if I would be like heading right towards a, a copper deposit without even knowing? Let's see. I can move the pointer. Take me alive. Okay. 
Okay, so we need 
All right. And now we got to go get some more copper. Okay. Now what? What did I do? Traveled 10,000 KS. I remember when I first got the game, the temperature was only in Celsius. So I wish they would give an option to change the travel to miles, because that would really put it in perspective for me. But it ain't a big thing. You know, we achieved it, but we might as well empty this out. Might as well get all of it. Caves tempting to explore, but no, we're following the storyline strictly. So we're, we're strictly going for the storyline for now. Actually, all the way to the end. If the story doesn't tell me to do it, I don't need to accomplish the story. I ain't doing it. We're doing that story mode stream. Okay, so we're gonna do the refiner. Oh, we need metal plating. Ah, cause I left my refiner in my in my building. Have to remember it's portable for a reason so we can take it with us so but i oh do i want to build a second one i guess i guess we'll put a second one This one will be my traveling companion. All right, so now we would have put some fuel in there. Ooh, not a lot. And we would do copper. And we need 125 of those. So we got 49 already. So I guess that would be 100 more? Maybe? Plus 50 is 100, and then another 25, so 75 more actually, yeah. 76 to be exact, I believe. I did math. Okay. So now we can install the hyperdrive. But let's pick this up first. Save the game. Yes, yes, we are. Alright. So now install the hyperdrive. Boom. Boom. Okay, objective complete. Now what? I'm guessing feel for it, but we shall wait. We shall wait. Okay. Auto Diagnostics Report. Hyperdrive successfully installed. Hyperdrive fuel status empty. My hyperdrive is complete. Perhaps I really will find answers out there amidst the stars. But without warp cells, I will be going nowhere. I need to find a source of antimatter. Tune scanner to antimatter. Mm -hmm. Search for antimatter traces with Starship, Starship Scanner. Scanner attuned to antimatter. I don't think I did this the first time in the game. I think I had to gather stuff for it. So it's going to be a little different. Okay. Okay, now it says, perform planetary scan from orbit. All right, so I got to go up in space for this one. So we're going to go into space. Okay. Now, let's see what happens when I push the scan. Scanning. 
antimatter, antimatter trace detected. Okay, reach the marked location. Ah, uh, this is on a completely different planet. Let's scan that planet. High temperature planet. Okay, so we're going to go right there. Go right there. About 14 seconds of drag. Save it and claim it. All right. <clears throat> so we're gonna name it. Jekyllo Rosam. Swamplands. Don't forget to follow Jekyllo Rosam in all media. Twitch and YouTube are the best ones. However, YouTube, you want to do Juggalo Rosam Gaming. Put that on the end, because the other channel is just general, where obviously the Juggalo Rosam Gaming is just for, you guessed it, gaming. All right. So let's get this party started. Ready to go over here to the Antimatter Trace. Offer shelter from hazards. Search bills for valuable materials and data. Okay. Be sure that it's not low. We're search here a little bit. That's not an anti-matter. I don't think it's one of these little guys. Maybe. Maybe. Nope. Let's, we got this. Got units. We got here. Oh! We got a universal language database. I'm going to learn a word. symbol. There we go. Alright. Here we go. Dessert terminal. We'll get that just because who knows, maybe I'll need it. Okay, now what? Terminal online. Select and key. Decrypting. Success! The terminal is clogged with an unnerving pulse hidden slime. Nevertheless, it appears to function. As I touch the input panel, the alien substance reacts violently. I make a note to avoid getting closer. The device opens, revealing a single unblinking crimson eye. It prints out a blueprint for antimatter, accompanied by a strange message. Take blueprint and read log. You will find us when the time is right. 
16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16. And there's the new recipe. Okay. So we gotta get condensed carbon chromatic metal. As long as we're here, we're gonna, we're gonna search because there might be some of that stuff in there. Hey, condensed carbon. Boom! There we go. Alright, so we're gonna craft this. Uh, let's go back to the ship first. Okay. Where did that ship go? There we go. some stuff yet, right? So we need the chromatic metal. Okay. So do I have enough stuff to do it already? Let's find out. Copper. It's weird how it doesn't tell me to, to make chromatic. Feels pretty low. And speak of the devil, we ran out of fuel. Okay, this episode of the Restart to Experience the Lowering Story Fresh in No Man's Sky Origins Part 2 shall end in about 30 minutes. We got 30 minutes left today. All right. carbon 6 of 20 I used the condensed carbon for the field of refiner um, condensed carbon 6 and how many more did I need 6 of 20 so 24 more Let's see, we need some carbon. Is that carbon? Should be carbon at the plant. Oh, look at that. Hold on, I'm gonna sneeze here, so, uh, I might wanna turn down the sound. <laughs> I sneeze with passion. All right. Plant looks like an octopus tentacle. See if that was enough. Okay, so view supply. And then carbon. Wait, it's not carbon. Alright, plenty.
Okay, assemble the antimatter housing. Gather ferrite dust for antimatter housing, 14 and 15. All right, so we need some more ferrite. Need some more ferrite, right? Yeah, yeah, that's great. We're not going to scan this stuff now because the story's not asking me to, and we don't want to waste the time in episode scan stuff at this point. So let's really move the story along. Moving along, but we're going to enjoy it. We're not going to skip anything. Okay. I think that's enough. There we go. Huh. Antimatter housing. That's the container it's in. I played this game so fast, I never really put two and two together that that's the empty container to put it in. I just thought it was a white thing. <laughs> that's the empty container to put it in. Antimatter housing. Makes sense. All right. We're going to wait for it to tell me. Okay. So now we're going to craft the warp cell. Guess what we do now? Well, it's flashing, so it didn't tell me. I'm going to go ahead and put the flash, though. Okay, we're gonna put this bad boy in there, and guess what? Okay. Hyperdrive refueled. Launch into space to test interstellar systems. However, I didn't forget about my refiner. First contact. We're gonna discover the warp drive right now. Okay, so we're going to go to the galaxy map, which we point down. Go over, hit X. Here we go. And I guess we're gonna go one over. Stretch my legs for a System reports hyperdrive error. Warp fuel depleted. Searching for fuel source. Searching. Searching. Obtained. Warp fuel source in 16, 16, 16, 16, 16. Accept guidance to fuel source? Sure, let's do it. Guidance accepted. Apply around. What do we got? Follow the automatic guide. Ah, there it is. There it is. Let's see it in the corner first. Okay. So here we go. Here we go. Let's get out of here. Whoa. Corvax echoes mean you no harm. Corvax will only exterminate if requested units are not delivered. Hmm. You know what? I'm new in the neighborhood, but I ain't going out like that. I ain't going to be no punk. Nah, man. We're going to go for it. You ain't going to get me. 
You gotta stand up to the bullies. Or they keep bullying you. But can I escape anyway? Nope. Alright, we're gonna fight. We're gonna fight in a brand new spaceship with not a lot of stuff. We're gonna we're gonna try. We're gonna try. Here we go. We gotta stand up to the bullies. There we go. That's right. That's right. I wasn't looking for no trouble, but I'm not gonna pay you money. No man. You earn your own money. You don't steal from me. You don't you don't you don't do that. Alright, here we go. Unknown man. Skeleton. Alright. Gonna arrive there in about twenty-five seconds. Insane Clown Posse, I, ICP, 9 p.m. tonight, Eastern Standard Time. They're doing a seminar. That's what I'm going to be watching. Oh, yeah. I think they're going to announce the next Joker's card. I'm thinking the Triplex brothers or brother Triplex, but we'll see. Nobody knows yet. <laughs> All right. Here we go. This structure is unlike anything I've encountered on my journey so far. Everything about it is so obviously alien, so obviously, obviously out, of space, out of place. As I stare at it, words form themselves in my mind. A strange fragment of broken speech. Is it traveler? Is it friend? Hmm. Is it traveler? Is it friend? I'm friendly, but I'm also a traveler. Let's do Traveler. Oh, that's a tough, a tough one. Uh, well, I'm not an enemy, so I don't want to present myself as a possible enemy. So I'm going to say, hey, I'll be your friend. If you'll be my friend, it's, it is friend. Let's see. It feels strange responding to questions I am unsure that I am being asked. But something has thoroughly taken notice of my reply. I am overwhelmed by a sense that something has awoken. That someone is watching me. Well, before this, I thought, at least I'm safe inside my mind. At least I'm safe inside my mind. But I guess not. It forms another question. Is it first? Is it last? Well, I'm going to be honest. I played the game a thousand hours before this, so this is not my first time. I'm going to say it is last. I do not know how I am being spoken to. This monolith is ancient. And I cannot escape the feeling. It has asked me these questions many times over. Brief pause for alerts. Okay. Nothing important. Alright. It asks again. Have they seen the Crimson Eye? Has the Crimson Eye seen them? Hmm. I remember earlier in this game, I did see a crimson eye, so I'm going to say it has seen the eye. Oh, both. Yeah, it's seen me. I looked at it, it looked at me back, so I'm going to say both. Likelihood of anomaly exceeds safety parameters. Breach detected. Alert. Alert. The boundaries fall, the walls collapse, your universe awaits. Find us, traveler. They gave me a warp cell. Find the mysterious messenger. Make your way into space. You know, I wasn't giving anything out any extra, but hey, a quick way to learn three more words. Come on now. I'm not going to read that part no more, but okay. You know, 
we're here, you might as well learn some words. Right? We might as well learn some words as long as we're here. Okay. Here we go. Ah. Another language milestone, I assume. Fifteen words. going to continue with the storyline mission. Find the mysterious messenger and make your way into space. Okay. Here we go. Now what? Explore nearby planets. Okay. Tune your spaceship communicator to the mystery signal access communicator with down. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Incoming transmission. Source unknown. You are not alone. Please identify yourself. I'm... Eh, identify myself, why not? Yo, it's Jungle Lil Roseanne, what's up? Woo, woo. You left me. Why did you? Tell them you don't understand. Tell them you're sorry. Eh... I'm not sorry. I'm just gonna say I don't understand. Of course you'd say that. Of course you'd just like the others. I should have said sorry. Dang it. Ask who you're speaking with. Ask about the others. There's no reply. The communica communicator falls silent, though the channel remains open. All right. All right. Coordinates received. So that's if I wanted to explore. Awakens, find us here. So that's what I'm doing. I'm doing the storyline, primary missions. Okay, travel to the stranger's coordinates. Okay. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Well, hello, stranger. How are you today? Oh, my. left on the stream. How far the storyline shall we get today? We shall find out. Alright. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Aha. A little crashed ship. We're going to land right here. Alright. That's a light. That is not a save thing. Never turn off. Never turn down free supplies. Ha! Huh, nothing found. Okay, I can't go in there. Never turn down free replies. Okay, lots of carbon. All right. Okay. I'm gonna go here. Main storyline, single beacon. Okay. All right, luckily I have enough ingredients already. Now what? There are no signs of life. There's only static of a broken communicator. Extract records. Whatever message was once here has been scrambled beyond recovery. Our extract is the pilot's name, Artemis. Whoever they were, they are long gone. The only other uncorrupted data is a set of plans, an upgrade for my mining beam. Yes! Nice! Nice, nice, nice! Okay, advanced mining laser. Now we're gonna let's see what this is. What a name of a ship, Desperation. 
Hmm. Compare spaceship. Well, this is a step up in class. It's a B. Uh, I got 15 slots. This gets 22. Hmm. Hmm, add to ship collection, nice. So I don't have to give up my old ship. So I might as well add it to my collection. So let me see something here. Hmm. Okay, so that's my, wait, wait a minute. Um, yeah, the symbol says that's my ship now. Your ship. But that's not part of the storyline yet, so I'm, I'm going to save that for a little bit. I'm going to go back in here. And I'm just curious, because I, I never tried this before. The ship is obviously broken. I'm just curious. Even though it's broken, will it let me summon it? Cannot launch starship damage. Okay. I didn't know if you could glitch it <laughs> like that. Um, I'm just curious. Would it take a lot of work for me to repair this? Let's see. Uh, yeah, we're going to have to let this go for now. We'll put a little, uh, a little marker here. We'll come back to that later. But, uh, yeah. We're going to the storyline. Don't tell me to do that yet, so, okay. Alright, alright, alright. So, search for clues about Artemis on this and other worlds. Okay, so. Oh boy. We need this again. Blue crystals and ferrite is what we're looking for. What's that? Um, probably ferrite. Maybe. Um, no, it's pure. Yeah, I just need a regular ferrite. Crystals. Nice big boy. Oh, can I do it? Or do I need the advanced? Oh, what a tease. What a tease. Thought I hit the jackpot, but no. Oh, look at these little creatures. Like a dinosaur with a rubber neck. There we go. There is a nice big chunk of ferrite. Okay. We got a couple crystals nearby here. Get rid of that guy. I don't trust him. Okay, blue crystals, where are you? You need more. far away from the spaceship and I have enough. At least for one more supply. Especially after a long walk. Alright. Okay, now we can make some fuel. 
How does that feel? How are you feeling? How does that feel? How do you feel? How do you feel? Okay. All right. Okay. And now we are supposed to... What? What is this? Um, okay. Search for clues. Option to access guide. Doing for clues, guide. Let's see what this says. Um, making discoveries? Hmm. Getting around? Doesn't really say anything about searching for clues. Search for clues on this and other worlds. Artemis entity, we received your signal. Is it first, is it last? Oh, so they think I'm Artemis. Hey, what's up, Vanfree72? As you can see at the bottom, I've done it. I've restarted a new game to redo the story. So I'm just doing the storyline, making a whole series to complete all the stories from beginning to end. Because I heard that... They switch the story up a little bit, like add a little bit to it, so I'm going to check it out. Alright, time for the truth. You have their signal, but you are not Artemis Entity. Tell the truth. Eh, might as well. Your signal is familiar to Nada. We have been kind. We have been in contact before, I think. This would be a good time to come aboard, yes? A proper introduction to our home. I'm actually getting off in about five minutes. Probably gonna do like a two hour stream of this storyline per day. I have some stuff to do. I gotta get off in a few minutes. But yeah, it's kind of cool starting over. I have 1,100 hours in the original save, so I thought, hey, you know what? Let's, let's start it over. All right. Let's see, what's the story going to tell me to do? Signal detected anomaly. Speak with the station's inhabitants. I'll go over it tells me to. So I'm just following the storyline for now. So we're going to go there as the goal. But yeah, check it out. I'm a newbie again. Look at this. This is a little pathetic ship. First ship of the game, my little tiny pew pew gun, <laughs> C class, and and way not not too much of anything yet. <clears throat> All right, here we go, buddy. All right. I am Priest Entity Mata, Divergent Corvax. Welcome to the anomaly. Our home here is pleasant, yes. Polo's own design. A perfect bubble beyond the Sentinels, beyond Ventral Corvax. Matter what does time come and go? Ask about Artemis. A traveler entity, perhaps they are known to you. I do not know their number. Matter does not care to think about iterations as numbers. They were lost to us, highly improbable. Our anomaly is lost to the Sentinels, but none should be lost to the anomaly. Corvex watches me. There is patience, our organic tilt, to the way they hold their metal shell. All right, let's ask about Nada. Nada awoke with the death of the Corvax Prime. Couldn't understand why such things happen. Why we are alone. Now I am divergent. The convergence do not see through my eyes. 
Nada is not alone anymore. Nada is with Paul friend. Now many other friends visit. Our convergence is small, but Nada happy. Is it Nada or Nada? I say Nada. Nada's care space, care pace, pulses with a gentle light. There is something familiar about them. Ask about Polo. Marco, Polo. Polo friend found Nada. Found my signal, Nada is safe. Now Nada finds other signals, makes others safe. The station has been calling to me since I woke up on the planet. Perhaps it is called Artemis as well. Perhaps it called to Artemis as well. Aha, so this dude woke up on a planet just like I woke up on the planet in the game. Okay. Maybe, anyway. Let's see. Ask about space station. Beyond what is outside, our anomaly wanders free. Free like Nada to observe, to search. The Sentinels, the Atlas, they do not care for this place. I feel their eyes hunting us. Nada watches me, judging my reactions as they speak. Leave. Speak with Polo Frank Traveler. Perhaps they might know more about missing Artemis. They perceive things more clearly than Nada. All right. So, Paul and Nada kind of a little bit of rebels doing outside the rules of, of this universe. Hey, what's up, buddy? Friends everywhere, if only you know where to look. Friends in all shapes, all sizes, all places. Artemis friend, you are where they should be. Does not seem possible, but all things are possible. Such is the universe. Huh. So this dude thinks I'm Artemis yet. Maybe I am. We will find them, no doubt. There is always a signal, always a trace. Ask how. Our home will see to it. When you leave, you will not be where you were. You will be closer. Or maybe not. Discovery is exciting, yes? Before you leave, perhaps spend some time with other friends. We all help each other here. All right. And let's see what's up. Okay. Uh-huh. I'm actually calling it a day because I got some other stuff to do, so we have just achieved the two hour time slot, but we'll go here. We'll do one more. Let's see. Ah, young one. You who still roam the boundaries of this universe. How I envy you. My time, my time out in reality has long passed, but I miss it greatly. Huh. So where we are now is not reality in the uh, anomaly, apparently. Perhaps you might help an old soul and share the things you've seen. I yearn for the stars, the glory of discovery, give data planets. Thank you, little one. You have no idea what this means to me. Please, take these nanites. They are nothing, but they are all I have now. Learn new technology blueprints. Okay. Just out of curiosity, does he do something different? Oh, what time is it? Okay, 27. Now I gotta get ready. Okay. Ask about their past. It is not worth dwelling on, young one. What has come before and what may come ahead, or what they are, it is too late for me now. Okay. Traveler new. Your suit is an extension of yourself. Let me aid you. Research exosuit upgrades. Okay. Jetpack.
Well, I may need to pick something up, so we'll get this guy. You see, see if this dude sees this, something different the first time. Have you stood before the Porter Stranger? Felt its leech the life from your skin. Felt the chest burn as its power starts to melt your very being. I thought not. If you have, fear will still live to tell about it. I stood before the portal at Solith Prime, but did not cross the threshold. I reached out. Only the tip of my finger grazed the gateway. The next moment, I awoke aboard the anomaly. I was transformed. The gateway here does not have the power of the ancient monoliths, though it shares aspects of the world. Use it as you wish, not with respect. Authorization required. Secondary simulation running. The machine hums along with the life and power that unnerves me. The terminal is scrambled to display unreadable. Uh, I'm not ready for this yet. All right, we're going to call it. It's a little bit past the two-hour mark of this episode. So I'm going to save the game. Oh, we're we'll talking to this guy. Or walk of mine. It would be rude not to say hello. A strange perfume surrounds this being. It is pleasant, if a little stale. They look startled when I address them. Oh, hello, new friend. We've not met. You know, that's it. It's traditional to introduce yourself with an exchange of units. Uh, all right, I'll do it. Thanks. Well met. Bye now. Stay. You're still here. Hmm. Sorry, friend. I don't have anything to trade. Smell them. Tethys looks uncomfortable with the pulse visible in their throat. It was like, <laughs> just give a big sniff. <laughs> All right, fine. Look, I admit it. I'm not a geck. I'm just another traveler passing through. <laughs> Ask why they lied. Tethys hesitates. Have you ever crossed paths with the Sentinels who patrol most of the worlds out there? Say you have not. Then you've been fortunate. I see you're carrying it in your pack. There's no way you got this far without raising a mining laser to some of resources this universe has to offer. Suffice to say, the Sentinels and I had a conflict of interest, and now it's in my interest to stay low here. But yep, that's today's episode of the reboot of my travels in No Man's Sky. So we're going to save the game here. I'll be back tomorrow. I usually go on sometime daily around 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Or a little bit after, a little bit sooner sometimes, but that's the average time. Peace out. See you tomorrow. Thank you.